A career in aviation includes more than just being a pilot or air traffic control, and kids are getting to see close up what those jobs entail at the College Park Airport Museum. News 4's Juliana Valencia has a preview of Latinas in aviation and how these local women are sharing the magic of flying. Karen Perez and Kiani Vallejo Fuertas aren't just breaking, but blasting through the glass ceiling in aviation. This is how I did it, and your child can do it too. As an aerospace engineer, Karen walks launch operators through the licensing process to get into space. Launch operators like Blue Origin, SpaceX, Rocket Lab, um, and one of my most memorable projects was uh, helping the uh, SpaceX Falcon Heavy uh, rocket, which is a huge rocket. Kiani was the first woman in 15 years to make it as an air traffic controller in Puerto Rico, even helping navigate during Hurricane Maria from Miami. So we had no radar, no frequencies. We were talking to aircraft through a third party called Airing, in which we would call them, deliver the message, they'd call the pilot and then vice versa. She now works at the Federal Aviation Headquarters in DC. No matter what career choice you have, there's a space for it in aviation because there's engineers, there's air traffic controllers, pilots, medical staff, uh, lawyers, editors, there's everything. There's a niche for you in aviation. Career options not on their radar until they were older. But the Latinas in Aviation event is aimed at sparking interest at a younger age. Donating something that Kevin Cabrera at the College Park Aviation Museum created it. And so as you look around the museum, and you see all the stories of pilots and people. There weren't really stories of Latinos. And so when I came across this book, Latinas in Aviation, three years ago, it really inspired me to say, hey, let's connect with these women. Let's fly them into this oldest operating airport in the world. And let's share their stories and connect them with our community. It warmed my heart so much to be able to see uh, so many little girls yeah. um, and be able to tell them what we do and for them to even say, oh, I love your hair. I have hair like yours. And for them to be able to see themselves in you, because I know growing up, I didn't see anyone uh, that looked like us. Connecting them with the community, but also with each other. Growing up and even in the field as an air traffic controller, there aren't many women that, you know, are part of, you know, the community. So being in a space where there was so many women from different parts of, within aviation that we got to share our stories was really interesting and inspiring. The Latinas in Aviation event is this Saturday at the College Park Aviation Museum from 10 to 4. And if you want to see some of the women flying in, that's around 1030. In Prince George's County, Juliana Valencia, News 4. Our team has been working hard to celebrate and honor Hispanic Heritage Month here at News 4. Make sure you tune in this Saturday at 9.30 a.m. for a half-hour Hispanic Heritage Special right here on News 4.